that really good that we're making them one dimensional? Is that something you guys are preaching again during this week? Yeah, uh, Oklahoma State, they're a team that wants to run the ball first. Uh, and we've done a great, great job. Uh, front seven's done, done a great job uh, with stopping the run. So. So they're good. they're gonna have to throw it around a little bit, which, which I'm excited for. Oh yeah, you know it hurts a lot. You know that. You guys have been making big plays on defense. I've seen you guys throwing up the old mob sign. Right. That was, that's a that's a throwback to the yeah. late nineties, early two thousands teams. Where did you guys uh, find that? What did you hear about it? Um, just coaches just putting putting old video up. Uh, those guys were just tenacious. They just ran to the ball, uh, fearless. Relentless, uh, and we just want to replicate that. So, yeah, we brought that back. Yeah. So that's where mob mentality comes from. Right. Right. Is there a sense that you don't maybe know which wide receivers you're going to see because they've had some injuries that guys could be coming back? Right. Yeah. Um, so really, while I'm preparing, or as we are as a defense, uh, pretty much we're just watching watching them all. Uh, so whoever shows up, we'll be ready for. Them. Does that does that make it challenging at all? A little bit trickier to do? Um, I wouldn't say so, just because like we've already faced uh, pretty good receivers, so there there's not there's it's usually just technique and just trusting your technique. So and I think we were coached well. So. Is there a sense where there's probably not a whole lot of surprises going into this week? It's the third time you guys have seen Spencer Sanders at this right. point. He's been there for a while. Yeah, and we know what they do. Uh, they, they like to run the ball, especially this year. I mean, they've kind of changed up what they have to do because of the, the players they've lost, like Tylen Wallace. Uh, and uh, so, so we're definitely ready and know we have a pretty good, good, uh, good knowledge of what they're going to do. A lot of praise through three games. You guys have been really good on the defensive side right. of the ball. Yeah. But if you were to look at the other side, what's one thing you feel like you need to be better at as a defense through three games? Um, as a defense? Mm -hmm. um, I mean, just making the, the tackles, uh, making easy tackles, uh, the open field, even tough ones, uh, open field tackles. Uh, I would also say just just comedic, communicating better because that can always improve. Um, so, for sure. And uh, you mentioned you think this is the best team you play on at K-State. It also seems like you guys are having a lot of fun out there. Obviously, oh, yeah. when you're 3-0, oh, it's always fun, but it's, right. it's, you get the vibe that you might have the most fun this year, too. Right, yeah. Uh, just like, I mean, like I said, like when you have guys just running running around and every you know everybody's hungry just to make a play, like it's just so fun celebrating and getting to see guys make plays, even if it's not yourself, just just showing love to teammates and having fun out there.